Good morning, guys. It's the day after Halloween weekend, Sunday morning, October 29th, 2017. I hope your night went better than mine did last night. Uh, it was uh, one of the most frustrating nights I've ever had. Uh, um, it's the busiest night of the year, and my Uber app quit working halfway through the night. I tried everything to get it working. I tried opening the app and closing the app. I tried uninstalling the app and reinstalling the app. I tried clearing the cache. Nothing worked. This is what finally worked. Uh, unfortunately, I didn't figure it out until this morning, so I was forced to only use the Lyft app last night, but it worked out with that 130% uh, boost that Lyft was offering in Center City. Um, so I made $100 before the app crashed, and then um, I made $120 with the Lyft app after that. So what I'm gonna show you is how I fixed it. First you want to do is uninstall the damn Uber app. Okay. All right. Yes, I do. I want to uninstall that. So after uninstalling app, let's clear the cache. Uh, honestly, guys, I really don't know if this uh, step is necessary, and I, I'm sure you'll let me know if it is or isn't, but um, it's it's what I did. So I, I don't want to skip it in case it is part of the deal. So I go into the Chrome, uh, look at history, clear browsing data, Now, I had it set for the last 24 hours, and I wanted to get rid of the cookies, site data, cache, cached images, and files. Clear the data. Okay. After that, you can close your browser. Then you'll want to go into your settings. Um, okay, back up and reset. Choose that. And this is what I found when I picked, saw that. We have automatic restore, and it's def by default it is set to when reinstalling an app, restore backed up settings and data. Uh, the problem I had every time I reinstalled it, it would ask me if it if I would allow location and things like that. And then it kept wanting me to uh, take off the permission of overlay. It kept detecting overlay every time I reinstalled it. And whether I turned it on or off, it wouldn't matter. The app would not start. It just would not start over. So I found this setting. Let's turn that off. And then you'll go back into your uh, Google Play store. and install the app. Okay, well, after that, guys, uh, you're gonna have to sign in again, choose your navigation again, choose what car you're gonna drive if you have more than one, and you're gonna get some tutorials and from, you know, 
like destination filter tutorial and things like that. All right, guys. Well, I hope this helped. I hope this helps somebody, anybody who had the problem last night. I can't believe how frustrating it was. And I honestly thought I was just not going to make any money. All right, guys. Well, let's uh, hope that all goes well for everyone. And we got a few more busy nights this year.